So I'm pulling this cable down now that was connected to the alternator because I think I found a place where it was shorting out, pressing up against a hot bolt that was hot even when I was only running the van for a few minutes. And I thought I saw a piece of copper sticking out, but of course the uh, side that was damaged possibly was unfortunately facing away from me. So I had to disconnect the starter. I'm pulling the cable down so that I can examine the cable going to the battery. And I'll turn the camera back on, but I wanted to record where I'm pulling this down from so I could remember where I have to put it back up. And as I had feared, as you can see, I've pulled this cable down, the heat shield is gone, and I have exposed copper. And that probably isn't good for any vehicle. And of course this was hidden well away, so now I have to apparently... Well, we'll see if we can repair this wiring before we actually try to pull everything out and replace it. But this was causing, apparently, my problem where my alternator wasn't getting able to start, probably because there was a short here. So, we'll fix this and we'll see if it works. So there's a better shot right there. You can see my yellow wire was melted and stripped apart. I'm not sure which one the yellow wire is, but if I had to guess, I'd figure it's the one that goes to the alternator. So we're going to repair that and see if that fixes our problem.